as a lot of restaurants and businesses prepare to reopen, people are anticipating a new normal, which involves a new level of cleanliness. So some businesses are turning to virus vaporizers. WCNC Charlotte's Brianna Harper explains how it all works. Your typical household cleaning supplies may not be enough to protect against COVID-19. Especially on a larger scale like a restaurant or business where services like this can come in contact with hundreds of people a day. That's the sound of sanitizing and it's becoming more and more popular nowadays. The need is high right now. For EnviroMaster of Charlotte, business is booming as they work to serve and sanitize for more than a thousand customers in the Charlotte area. That includes office spaces, gyms, grocery stores and restaurants like Tacos for Life in Concord. We're doing everything we can to protect our staff and protect the guests that are walking in the restaurant. Once indoor dining reopens, the owner says they'll certainly practice social distancing and provide sanitizer to everyone. But they're also taking it a step further by using the virus vaporizer. It puts a positive charge on the chemical that goes through the gun. And that allows it to appear very well to the surface of the spring. Most businesses take the surface weekly, and studies show the effectiveness is almost instant. It kills up to 99.9% of the germs within a few minutes of the application of the product. And we're told the best part is the disinfectant is strong, but not harmful. It kills everything from the coronavirus to staph, strep, flu, norovirus. Uh, and is really effective against all of those things, uh, but it's safe around people. People Tacos for Life hopes to see come and eat safely inside the restaurant soon enough with the help of all the extra resources in place. We add in a couple dining room attendants just to make sure we have everything getting wiped down on, on a regular basis. We're spending the, the labor dollars to make sure that we're taking care of our, our guests. There's also plenty of other health and safety changes happening at Tacos for Life. Just visit our WCNC mobile app to learn more. Brianna Harper reporting at WCNC Charlotte.